The big news of the day earlier at Purdue, the hiring of a new athletic director. Purdue introducing its replacement for outgoing AD, Morgan Burke. He's Mike Bobinski, currently the athletic director at Georgia Tech. Bobinski has served as Georgia Tech's AD since 2013, and before that, Xavier and Akron. As a Notre Dame grad, he listed a love for Indiana and the Midwest as a reason the Purdue job was attractive. But most importantly, I look at this as a really unique situation where you've had this incredibly stable leadership. You've got a program that's very, very well managed, but I believe is sort of in the starting box, you know, just positioned in a way to really take off. Chairman of the Board of Trustees Mike Berghoff says initially he had a list of more than 50 names under consideration for the job. President Mitch Daniels himself saw more than a dozen candidates. We saw Mike right at the front end. I thought, man, they're all like that. <laughs> he said, this is one competitive SOB, and secondly, but he's, 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 he, he would fit us. While Bobinski comes off as a likable guy, his competitive fire was mentioned more than once during the half-hour introduction. His biggest task as incoming AD is moving a struggling football program in the right direction. While he acknowledges there's no easy way to turn things around, there's a number of factors he'll consider. Is there a sense of direction? Is there, is there a, can you see ahead to a better day? Is there sort of a building block in place or a, a, a sort of a set of building blocks in place that you can logically assume are going to lead to greater success? Are players being developed? Are you recruiting the right young men? Are they, are they doing well academically? Are they good citizens? Bobinski ended his introduction by reaching out to the Purdue community. He says success at the highest level of college athletics requires support from everyone. There are no pretenders in the Big Ten at this, at this level and at the Power Five level. You, you've got to have an all-in commitment. I certainly feel that from the leadership of Purdue, uh, but I would ask the Purdue family, the extended Purdue family, to, to stay together, to stay, stay involved, and stay supportive. We'll need everybody. Now, President Daniels declined to share the specifics, uh, the specifics of Babitzi's contract, only saying that he signed a multi-year contract and that that contract would be in the top quartile of his peers as Division I athletic directors. Now, Babinski has some loose ends to tie up at Georgia Tech, but he expects to be in place at Purdue by the Boilermakers' first home football game on September 3rd.